This is Airedale Weekly News, providing you with the latest updates across the schools. It's been another busy week here at Airedale Junior and Infant Schools. This week we have welcomed back some more key workers' children, which shows us the country is taking st steps to safely get back to business as usual. Year 6 found out about all their transitioning in their live webinar last week. It was really interesting. We're, we have a special question and answer session today with Vice Principal from Airedale Academy as well, which I am really looking forward to. The adults have telephoned all the Year 2 parents and the Year 5 parents this week to invite them into school. This means that next week more children can come back to school safely and see their friends and take lessons with their teachers. Now over to Danielle with the weather. Another rainy day in Airedale. I hope you're all okay and sa staying safe indoors and having fun indoors. And because I'm the news anchor, and I can, that here's some fabulous work that I am really proud of. I've brought my friend's work along as well. With the departure of the oldest children in year six, for their next adventure in secondary school comes an arrival of 110 new year three children in September. I know the staff are really excited to meet the children and their parents in the next few weeks. The children have lots of questions that they have been sending to school and I know Alfie has, is keen to be make sure that they are answered. He likes to dig deep in his investigations. So let's go to our roving reporter Alfie who is reporting from the year three. We only have a few children today as their parents are key workers, but they are all from the same bubble to keep everyone safe. Thanks, Georgia, but what's going on here? We're having a picnic! This time last year, all the Year 2 children got to come to school and have a picnic with us, and you all took part. It was good fun, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> this year, though, we can't have Year 2s coming for their picnic, which is a real shame. So I've set a competition, so all the Year 2 sitting at home can have their own virtual picnic and send their photographs to the Year 2 email address. We're looking forward to seeing their entries. We've got a pirate picnic and a pizza picnic already sent in. The names of the new Year 3 teachers. So in Year 3 this year we have Miss Ibbert, Mrs Hall, Mrs Sutton and myself, Miss Norton. Will there be a worry monster like there is in year two? Yes, there will. There'll be a worry monster in each classroom and you'll have the learning moments as here's Miss Bradley. Hi, I'm Mrs Bradley. These are our worry monsters that we have around the school. Um, you will also have myself and some other learning mentors. You will see us bobbing around and if you ever need to speak about any worries, we can always help you to try and solve them. Lou wants to know about what sort of stories you learn about in English. The Tim Forest, we also have the Stone Age Boy. Ivy wants to know about after school clubs, sports, computers and cooking. There are lots of after school clubs available. Um, but we're just awaiting government guidelines at the moment to see which clubs will be available in September. Where do Year 3 play out? Year 3 and 4 play out at the bottom end of the school. There will be some equipment out and a major trail and some dinner ladies to take care of any problems. Will I come to school in my PE kit one day a week or bring my PE kit in a bag? Year three all come in their peak all day and come in the shoes. What are the classes called? The classes are called Griffin, Dragon, Phoenix and Unicorn. Layla wants to know about her new class teacher. When can she meet them? Well, we're going to be really excited next week because all the class teachers are going to be phoning up the children that are in their new classes and they're going to speak to all the grown-ups going to invite them into a meeting where they'll be able to see the classroom, they'll be able to look around the Year 3 building and find out a little bit, bit, bit more about being in Year 3. 
TJ wants to know about friends in his class and how they were chosen. Alfred, that's a really easy question to answer, but it was very hard this year because normally I ask the children if they want to pick some friends out that they want to be in class with. This year I've had to rely on the very, very good teachers, Fairdale infants and Townville infants, and they've helped put the children into classes. Layla wants to know what the school dinners are like. Speaking of dinner, it's time to end my dinner. Over to you, Georgia. Oh, goodness me, I better dash. I'm doing the meeting in two minutes. See you all next week.